Hello friends, uh, I am Parwes and this is our fourth video in developing, developing uh, Qt Quick applications with QML and Qt5. Uh, in previous video we have uh, covered uh, the basics of uh, rectangle and also the basics of text in QML and we have made a simple rectangle we have uh, we we have give it uh, a radius and also we have give it a color to this rectangle and we make this like a, and we made this like a button uh, you can see the previous code uh, we have a window uh, the width is 600 height 600 the color is green and in between the window a uh, window is a parent a parent element and these uh, uh, rectangle and mouse area and text these are uh, child elements and a rectangle we have ID we have width we have white we have color brown and also we have anchors dot center and we want to center the rectangle and the parent also we have a border width it and also border color to blue and radius to 50 and in here we have a mouse area uh, in this section we have text we give it a uh, color white and this is the text get a quick application the visible is true uh, the font style is times new roman and also uh, the font is bold font dot bold is true uh, font dot point size is 20 and also it is in the center anchor anchors dot center in is parent uh, today we are going to discuss about another uh, QML element that is mouse area uh, uh, basically, uh, now if you run this application, you can see that because it is uh, anchors dot fill parent. If we click in every sec section, uh, if you click in every section, uh, this window will be closed. If I click in here or in, uh, I click in this section, but in every section, if I click, the window is closed. But I want to uh, give it a functionality that uh, when I click on this, uh, like uh, this is like button. If we suppose this is a button, if we click on this button, uh, this window should be closed. Uh, for this purpose, you should uh, you can see that I have an ID for my rect rectangle one, okay, uh, and anchors dot fill in this section you should remove the parent and make it rect one like this now if you run your application uh, now if I click in here in this section nothing will happen but if I click uh, in this section you can see the application is closed like this okay uh, now we are going to cover some more about mouse area uh, you can uh, enable the hover uh, let me in this section you can hover enabled and make it to true uh, and also in this section uh, we can give it uh, on entered on entered uh, when I entered in the button I want to uh, bring some changes to button. The first thing I want to uh, change the color uh, rect one dot color. Uh, you this rect one is my rectangle ID. Uh, <coughs> make it uh, blue and uh, make it blue. And now if I run this, uh, if I run this simple window. And cumin, you can see that if I bring, you can see that it is uh, uh, blue. Uh, let me run it again. Yeah. Now, if I uh, enter, you can see that the button or this rectangle became blue. Okay. Uh, now I want to add another functionality. I I want to uh, rotate uh, by 45 degree. Uh, for this, you can take your rect one ID. Uh, dot rotation uh, make it 45 <coughs> now if you run this applic window and yeah it's now well, let me now if I bring my mouse in here you can see that it is uh, 
rotating 45 degree okay now I want to the text should be rotate also with this rectangle for this uh, let me check that I don't have any ID for the text for this you should give an ID for text I give it text 1 and in this section you can take your text one dot rotation and make it 45 degree now if you run this you can see that now it is uh, rotating text and rectangle but it has a problem there is a problem uh, if I enter in here and when I exit from this section, this uh, rectangle should be in his uh, in the first uh, stage. It should be like the uh, it should be by default. Okay. Uh, now for this, you need uh, another thing that is on exit it on exit it. Okay. For this, you can simply copy these and. Uh, the red dot color uh, because I have by default blue uh, rectangle I have the color is brown not blue uh, I have brown make it brown and change this to zero and uh, change this to also zero now if I run this and if I enter in here you can see that it's rotating but if I you can see that it is in the first section. Enter, exit, enter, exit. Uh, let me run this again. Enter, enter, exit, enter, exit. Uh, okay, thank you guys. This was our fourth video. Uh, and also, mm, please, for the further videos, please subscribe my channel. And also, please like the videos.